Hello and welcome to ARCA at Charlotte this week. Week 13's over. I'm very glad. Because now I get to go get back in the ARCA car. My favorite. And, uh... We'll see how this one turns out. Because Charlotte's, uh... Well, it's a mile and a half, but it's not always my favorite one. Uh, mile and a half. Especially like the tri -oval area. It gets really narrow over there. And it gets uh, really tense, so... Uh, a little uncertain about that. Uh, also, the setup this week, it's loose on cold tires, but... It's pretty tight, that it looks like, over time. So that's going to be interesting. And uh, I had the fastest lap in the open practice, but it is kind of late at night and stuff. And uh, I mean, you can see I'm the number two, unfortunately. Didn't quite get to the bottom there where I wanted to be. It's not exactly Whoa. how I want to do that. Let's see if we can uh, improve on lap two. About a tenth off my best to that first lap. Try to do a little better here. I feel like the grip went away. I feel like the grip went away on the second lap there and couldn't get through uh, three and four as well. So I think that's actually slower. Seven, five, eight, seven, five, five, five. So it's barely any faster. Uh, I think first lap probably is your best lap just because of the extra grip you get. So if I didn't mess up one and two, or three and four rather, maybe I'm a little better. Um, don't think I was in, <laughs> gonna get a six two eight though. That's a little bit better than what I think I was gonna do. My best is a six four seven. That's what I got. That uh, had me on the on the top in open practice. And there were guys in there that were like, "Yeah, whoever these people getting these times, they must be using a controller or something. There's no way <laughs> using us a G eight and stuff." Okay. Ignore that. So that was kind of funny. But uh, we got the chat. Speaking of chat, let's see if that's on. So we're we're gonna have an okay starting spot. Looks like maybe top five. If we don't fall any further. But you definitely want to, don't want to be running those fast laps during the race. I'm gonna try to keep this thing from falling off real bad. And hopefully, at the same time, don't get run over, too. Because some people aren't going to be so interested in saving, probably. And, uh, well, I just I hope they know how to not just plow into the back of me. We'll see, though. So, not, like I said, the number two. I was hoping we'd be not so low a number. Because we had about, like, 60-ish people sign up, I think. Because it is later in the day. Because I just got back from work. It's approaching midnight right now. So, it is kind of later at night. But we did have, like I said, about 60 people sign up. So I was hoping we'd get some uh, higher I rating than me in here. And we only got one, I guess. Unfortunately, so. Pressure's on, as usual. It says we're supposed to finish second. We'll see about that. A lot of it's going to have to do with, uh, am I going to be able to save tires? Like, am I going to have the ability to do so? And am I going to be able to save tires as in, are they going to let me behind me or are they going to just run me over? <laughs> so, that's the big question. And, well, we'll see what the answer is, I guess. Just one moment. Alright, sorry about that. We're back in. Probably One best to, to just cut out waiting for the grid anyway. Here we are. We ended up P4. So we got some good position. That's terrible. Um, <laughs> there you go. Let's <laughs> checking out the field, seeing what we've got here. The number one guy is, started, is starting eighth. See how uh, they're able to climb. Right, right, right. right. 
I do wonder. Um, that family. Of what was I wondering? I forgot what I was gonna say. I'll be honest. <laughs> hey, tell you what's going on. Not got this weird start here. Look at that one in Oh no. Oh, that's right. That's what I was gonna say. Um, I wonder how much track position is going to matter because watching Gavin's race where I learned that it looks like the setup's kind of tight I also learned that uh, the race was the race was looking kind of pack racing ish that's making me wonder uh, if that's what it's going to be looking like so I'm wondering maybe it would it was good to get a good qualifying lap in I'm happy with where I got and fourth I'm wondering how tough it's going to be pat to pass and stuff with people all on top of each other. We'll see how it goes. Hey, they are going, I guess. Dotty. Seems like we started moving really quick. <laughs> so we're gonna be following Ace Elliot. We're gonna be following Planters Peanuts wow, and uh, Throwback oh. Kevin Harvick. <laughs> That's what we're gonna be buying. Chris, I hate to inform you, but you have to be on my side. Yeah, Chris. I hate to tell on you. It's yeah, like the, it is going to have a little bit of tire spin, but I think I want to be in first gear. So that's what we're going to be doing. Going to have to be a gentle start. Come on, Gil. If you all could just stay up high and down low, I'll just drive right to the middle like Moses part in the sea, and all will be well. Just, just take the back. talking about? Just keep it cordial. About to go green. Stay focused. Cordial. Good luck, guys. Get ready to carry on. Time to do your job. And this guy got a really bad start in front of us. Green flag. Green flag. Kind of held us up a bit. It's fine. Got him sleeping behind us though, so that's good. Car outside. Still there. Yeah. I'm able to drive by Mr. Peanut. <sighs> I hope I'm able to save tires. Okay. Traditionally not all that great at it. So I've always, uh, I'm trying to learn all the time, trying to learn what works and what doesn't. So we'll be able to do it done today. I'm going to try to keep it close to this line. It seems to get the car turning better when you're down there. Yeah, let me should have done this already, but session last lap. It's a little bit of break too. Yeah, wait to get on the throttle till about you know second half of the corner, and then gas it up on uh, the bottom line. It is a uh, St. Patrick's Day today. Anyway. I'm starting to wonder if some of the people here have been participating in the festivities. I'll leave it at that. <laughs> there were some people talking in practice that were sounding a little, a little off. <laughs> but it's, uh, who knows? Who knows? So far, so good. I'm wondering if Kevin Harvick up there is going to be burning his tires off, or they're just really good, and they're able to go that fast uh, and save the tires. Very happy with the position I'm in, though. We've got space behind us. We've got the big one. Put it out. Put it out. Jesus fucking Christ! God. I was in 20 seconds. Reckoning good, I guess. Oh God, I hope we don't come up on something. No cautions in the Arca series, of course. The lap time was 31.2. 20 seconds. What the hell, people? Oh my god, there there are a few cars looks like they're junked up here.
do have a 16 to 1 steering ratio here today. Help with the tires, help prevent me from turning the wheel too much. See how well it works. I'm feeling okay though. God, people. Yeah, I'm done with this race. Hey, bye, bye, sir. I'm going back to the truck. This, this is crazy. <laughs> Did not have a very good time. Ooh, Chase Elliott's in the wall. Big, all the cars flying around. <laughs> Time was at 31.2. Alright, well, that's not what you like to see. Is <laughs> people coming out of the pits and getting on the racing line. That's kind of scary. There's some squirrels out here right now. Hey, Shepard, what's my ass look like? Is it pretty? I'm just gonna call this video like Happy St. Patrick's Day or something, probably. <laughs> People will get the message. Yeah, Shepard. <clears throat> oh no, Mike for his leader, okay. So we've got uh, the 11. Coming up on us just a little bit. I don't feel like the car is falling off per se. I'm just kind of trying to stay ahead of things and uh, keep the car turning and whatnot. Uh, whoa! I'm just I'm seeing some really scary, really scary lap cars ahead. Chicken streakers, as Nick would put it. That's concerning me. Man, that seven's gone though. Maybe he won't fall off. I think I'm doing an okay job though for the long run. It feels it's feeling pretty good. It's turning still. I mean, we're only on lap ten, but a little bit that it's kind of been changing. It's been very minor. Are there no yellow? I take it. Uh -huh. No, sir. That would have been helpful. Guess that uh, guy's new to Arca. Arca never has had yellows, as far as I know, unless they did like way back in time or something. You'll get me, Shepard. Is this lap car that's on the mic to get holding up the leader? Here, if I can. That lap was at 31.5. Okay, Colton. Lap times are pretty consistent. You know, I, kinda, I do like Charlotte when I don't have to be like too wide through the uh, trial. <laughs> it's really the tribal that keeps me from liking this track so much because, well, bad things have happened there before. People trying to make, like, it's just, it's real tough for people to get through there side by side, it seems like. It's, uh, basically running on our own here. Running in a nice spot, too, up at the third. Feeling good. It's a nice drive. Get the uh, turn in, exit. Get that bottom line. Cool to start uh, gaining back on some guys up here. If we're, if they're gonna fall off, I'd like to start seeing it soon. Be a nice gift. They did indeed overdrive their stuff. Of 
course, would want enough time to be able to do something about it. It's like Chase Elliott looking like up there. Almost hit the wall. Hit the wall again on exit. Like they quite did go. They're kind of getting stuck by this lap, uh, lap car. Maybe, maybe they're just now approaching them. That looks like they're letting them by. That's what you like to see. Oh, actually, <laughs> they got the run on the high side. Never mind. Go low here, Parker. Oh, the ball on entry that time. He's making mistakes. We're gonna be reeling them in. Gained a couple tenths, but we haven't been gaining too much. That lap time was 31.8. That's good consistency. Keep it up. There is a whole slew of lap cars ahead. Oh my God! The leader's wrecking. Slow car ahead. Go low, go low. Right the next car's the leader. Go high. Can't slow down too much. Well, that was awesome. We made it through, and now it is us and Chase Elliott. Sorry, five, that wasn't the best way to do and, that. And uh, the 11, who apparently made it through that as well. No idea what happened there, but I bet the leader's not happy. turn of events that really stinks for the seven. Okay, we've got a lap car approaching at Mach 5. I'll give you the bottom here. Go to the bottom, now did he? Oh, fresh tires or whatever. There at the bottom. Clear inside. Okay, that lost us all this time. Inside. Clear inside. Car inside. Still there at the bottom. Still there. Hold your line. Now Peanut Man is here. Still there, hold your line. Stay high. Clear inside. Overdrove that, because I was afraid he was going to dive bomb it on us, Me but... Too. Unless he's gonna try again. Rotating. I'm just gonna give this Still to there. the other guy, I guess. Still there at the bottom. Still there inside. Clear inside. I'm kind of irritated that 20 felt the need to race us, because that lost us a ton of time. And then, like, he lollygagged about it. Like, I gave him the whole corner in 1 and 2, and he should have been able to get by us really quick with how fast he was approaching us on his fresher tires or whatever. I, I don't know how that was possible. He fixed damage, and then, I, I don't know. I don't know how he has fresher tires, but it was very clear that he did. Wastes our time. Get by. So maybe he'll go catch the six now. <laughs> Wastes their time as well. Are right, starting to feel tighter though. Did not help having to fight side by side for the spot with the eleven. Mate, you gonna let me go to the left or the right? Go low. What's happening there? Right. It's backwards. I don't know if he's just 
being a problem or if <laughs> we legitimately wrecked. Tires aren't feeling good anymore. Ever since uh, I had to go to the high side and battle for a while, they have not been feeling very good. Okay, Colton. Cup times are pretty consistent. Make sure I'm hitting my marks down on the low side by the uh, by the line. Okay, I want to use more brake. Turns three and four now too. This thing turned. In to go, it's gone by. Up lap time was 32.3. Took a bit of a bad angle into the corner there. Kind of just holding even with the leader. Fortunately, I don't think we're gaining much at all. <laughs> if at all. Will if he keeps hitting the wall like that, though. That's what I like to see. What I don't like to see is lap cars fighting each other in front of me. Please don't come down and hit me. Still there, hold your line. Clear outside. Seven's nice to us. Let me go, let me go. Still there, hold your own. That last line was at 32.6. Keep low. And okay, no thanks for me if you're gonna hold on to the side. What are you doing? Why are you fighting me, Seven? Keep low. <sighs> Clear high. I'm trying to push you past and pull them out on the wild race. I mean, sorry to be grumpy. I'm just, I really want to try to catch this leader. to do it though. We're gaining but not quick enough. We need him to hit the wall real hard again. Like seven says pass left, it's like yes I would love to. So, please don't hang on to my right side. Like, I don't know. We're at about a second, but we're going to be coming to two to go here. We'd have to gain about half a second each lap, but I just don't think that's happening. Unless he makes a major mistake. 
we're catching this guy in a bad time too. Don't like bump drafting in Arca Car. Now that guy said he was trying to help me. Guy is blocking me as a lap car. Very frustrated. I'm seeing this race. Good win, six. Good racing with you guys. Thank you. Good race. Alright, there's the ticket flag. Alright, well, we ended up P2. Good race, P2. I wish we could have got caught in right there. Just needed a few more laps. <laughs> Good race in five. I know I screwed you up there a few times, so sorry about that. Alright, we will get it parked. Yeah, we were catching them. Uh, maybe if we don't run into some of those guys that gave us trouble through the field, maybe we could have caught them. But there, you also got to think, like, the 7 totally got screwed over, too, probably. Unless that's, uh... <sighs> Unless that was his fault. We'll find out, but... Uh, you can play the... Could have been, should have been. Yeah, that, that uh, sucked, Shepard. That was pretty bad. I don't know what was going on with him racing you that way. Yeah. Seven. Great. Speed. Yeah, that stinks. Like I said, uh, we got to think. Uh, yeah, I, don't, I, I think Shepard had in the back. Great. We'll see what happened. So the number one, I was wondering, uh, oh no, he just gets run over. I was wondering if we were going to see him eventually, and then this, this is why we did it. Epstein just runs in the back of him. <laughs> Thanks, man. We'll oh, this is the big one they were talking about. Oh my god, and the Arca breaks. Is. Here they come. It's plowing in. <laughs> That's why they call them Arca Breaks. I think these guys plow in too. Yeah, it just, it just doesn't even look like they try to dodge it even. Like you can slow down and like try to cut down the apron or something. You can probably make it by. No, just... When he slows down for it, and then the 19's like. Nah, I already slowed down. Time to, time to jam it. Play. Oh my gosh, they're still piling in. How many people were in this wreck? And how long did it happen? Look how far back this guy is. He's on the other side of the track when it starts, and he still finds a way to get in it. I mean, maybe he couldn't see it. Man. What a collision. I'm glad this cleared up before we got around the track, because that's what I was worried about seeing. <laughs> like, it's just they're blocking the track. That's insane. So by the time that the leader gets over there, looks like it's mostly cleared, so that's good. We come around and we see, like, oh gosh, what's going on? But uh, little did we know what had already happened. The, the eventual winner, he plowed the wall a couple times. Kind of wondering if they had damage and they still were able to hold it up. Hold, hold us off up there. Let me check my tires. I'm curious. 
73.89, so I could have been better on him probably. But I did push pretty hard at the end there trying to uh, catch him. I did use him up. Some wall hits once in a while here. So this is the leader crashing. Seven's kind of in his lane, I'll be honest. You see the, the lines on the track. And then the 22 comes down. Yeah, I don't know. Seven couldn't have given him more room, but it is the 22 that's moving down the track. I just, I don't think I trust lap cars that much as the leader. As the leader, I'm giving him too much room. Because, because exactly this reason, you know. Yikes. And then we had to slow down pretty good for this one in order not to be in it. How did the uh, six get about it? He gets caught up in this and we win. Most likely. So he got pretty lucky there, I think. That they bounced the way they did. Meanwhile, I was slowing down real good. Until I saw that it was uh, no longer a danger. So I'm thinking I probably, let's see. I slowed down to about 125 at minimum. And where did the 6 slow down to? At minimum. Uh, he slows down pretty good, but he was already in it by the time he did slow down, basically. So he kind of like had to slam on the brakes. So we both slowed down to about 123 to 125 area. So I was just curious to see if either one of us was uh, more aggressive. So the 7, after losing the lead, is moving around on track for some reason. Uh, I don't know. I feel like after you get that damage, you might... I guess he's kind of near pit road. I was going to say maybe just tow, but... Uh, he kind of stutter stops, and then the 19 just decides to plow into him. I mean, he's kind of in his way, but should be able to avoid this. Sounds like he's gassing it up. <laughs> to hit the 7, I don't understand that. He's going to get the wall. Wall. Oh. I'm going to get a lot of wall. Uh-oh, what happened here? 13 clear himself. 15's got a massive run. He's going to the outside. Ooh, maybe he doesn't get enough to the outside. Hard to say. Yeah, he kind of like almost gets loose, it looks like, through the dog leg, or not the dog leg, but the trioval. So he like turns left too much, and you need to be over here. It's this, uh, it's this trioval though. It's tricky, and that's why it causes a lot of accidents. Uh, that's what happened there. Okay, so this guy wasn't just messing around, he really did get turned there. Because we came by, I'm like, what is happening there? <laughs> Does this guy get into him? How? Just doesn't see him and he's probably lo not looking far enough ahead, I guess. Yeah, he just does not react in time. You can see him starting right about here. But he's still gassing it up all the way up to there. And that was the difference, I think. Like, if he noticed this a little sooner, he probably was able to avoid it. Thing's gonna hit the wall again. Wall again. So we're the lap cars kind of fighting in front of us. Be curious to see what the strength of field was on this one. It does seem like we had some newer drivers, maybe, on the higher numbers. Ken is still 
hitting the wall. I mean, not really that time. One is making a green flag pit stop? We're trying to, I guess. That was interesting. And that's it. So, we got a great finish. Um, I'm a little bummed, because I do feel like I could have caught the six. Um, and he managed to get the win despite hitting the wall pretty solidly at least three times that I saw. And uh, I just I feel like ugh, things went a little bit differently. I could have got there. But you can't feel too bad about a two uh, or a second place finish and uh, a zero X in a race where I was one of two people that got a zero X, apparently. Me and the leader. So pretty solid. Uh, we got the second place that we were allegedly supposed to get. So all right. Good stuff. Leaves me thinking what if, but I hope you enjoyed. Uh, it was a fun race. I still enjoyed uh, enjoyed racing as well. And I will see you uh, see you again soon. Thanks for watching.